Welcome back to Boring Reviews. Boring Land. Oh, Come just on. kidding. Blasphemer. Oh, Hello, my. Boring Review Nation. Kind of pointless. We know all things. All right, welcome back to Boring Reviews. Thanks so much for clicking on this video. Nick here. Joey there. And since you already clicked on the video, just a few more clicks and you can sit back and relax. Please, if you like what you see here, don't forget to like it, then subscribe if you haven't already. And last but not least, hit that notification bell so you are aware of our next upload videos. And it's singular to plural. I love it. <laughs> and uh, we're going to have more uploaded videos, so you don't want to miss out on those. Today we're going back to something we haven't seen in a month or two or so, and that's the Village Cooking Channel. We love this channel so much. We've done more than a handful of video reactions to this channel, and I think the last one we did was a fruit salad reaction, if I'm not mistaken. And here's another fruit one. This is rambutan fruit. I don't know what that is. Nope. 100 kilogram rambutan fruits for cooking fruit pickle recipe. I'm really hoping it's that curd rice and pickle recipe right there. What is, yeah, that's, listen, listen, the, the people that want the easy way out, they go for that last part. I read the entire thing. I ate the whole plate. What do you think is a fruit pickle? Because <laughs> I have no idea. Is it like sour fruit, like pickled fruit? No, but maybe when you pickle it and you put it in that like thing and it pickles it. Isn't that what I just said? Oh, yeah. Oh, Whenever you put in that thing and it pickles it, Nick. <laughs> uh, we remove the seeds from the fruit so we get a delicious pickle. Uh, Finally, we enjoy it. And maybe it's just called a pickle. Maybe it's not the same thing as our pickles. I don't know. Not sure, but beautiful where they're at right here. If you want to see more of our reaction from Village Cooking Channel, we have it here on the channel. Feel free. There'll be a few suggestions for you to go crazy with. Go crazy. Go crazy. Go crazy, folks. Go crazy. Famous baseball like, call oh, I was from the say, shot around the world. I was 1955 say, Giants. It's that part in Yo Gabba Gabba. Go crazy. Go crazy. That too. They stole from the, the call, probably. Oh, okay. Here we go. How far do you think you can carry something like that on top of your head without dropping? Because they make it look like it's super easy. Good balance, too. I think I can go at least 50 steps. Yeah. Amazing bounce. Oh, oh, those are weird looking. I mean, it's not, it's fine. So it goes Very like different. spiky or they just like yeah. soft spikes? Well, they can't be yeah. super spiky because they're just picking up with their hands. Ooh. What? Can you just eat that raw? That looks pretty. looks like pretty. a Rocky Mountain oyster. What does it taste like? Look how easy that is. No, never seen Are they like, like cut a little bit first or just squeezing it? That is nuts. Can you imagine breaking open all of those? They look almost like blowfish. At first they look like little cacti. No, so they are they are cutting it with a knife first. Mm -hmm. Maybe not. Juicy. I saw one guy with a knife. Is it sweet? What does it taste like? I want one. <laughs> I like that look. Mm. <laughs> Almost like a seductive look. <laughs> oh, don't cut yourself like that. This guy is a master. You're like 10 hours later. <laughs> Still cutting them. Look at all that in their bowls. I wonder if the shells like offer any kind of nutritional value whatsoever. I don't know it seems about like such a waste. I want one. It's like an orange peel. You just throw away the orange peel. But you can actually use the orange peel for a little bit of zest in a drink or for flavoring. Okay, a banana. You throw away the banana peel. But you can actually. Yeah, you're right. Kiwi, you tend to throw away that peel. I'm just saying, it's such a unique shell. I want to know what that fruit is. I want to buy one, try it Are out. Are they adding sound effects? That just sounds so hypnotizing. And now what? Oh, don't tell me you're going to cut each one. <gasps> and take the pit out? Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, how exhausting. 
I get 10 hours later. But they seem to like get along so well. They're just chilling. They're just chit-chatting. Right. My legs would be hurting so bad. Something like that. Yeah, that seems exhausting. Those uh, pits look like almonds. Right? <laughs> Replant them, make some more. That's when like, you do all that. You're like, dude, you're not going fast enough. I'm going fast than you. Come on. Mendayam! <laughs> I guess you roast the seeds. Oh, yeah. Oh, and then you Grind them. chomp them up. Okay, so who was a genius that thought... And maybe this is a very common thing for spice. Thought, well, let's cook the seeds first. Or right? Whatever, yeah, the seeds. At one point, somebody had to think of it. Peppers? Maybe? I'm I just don't know how it's not going off the edges. I'm always amazed at how skillful they are with that. Yeah. Didn't realize mustard seed or what? Oh, look at that. It's a whole lot of oil. Can I fry it? It's that fruit. I'm gonna have to find where that fruit's at. It's in there. It's like fried. Yeah, it does. It looks like an onion for sure. Often that you cook a fruit. No. In oil with garlic and ginger. Tomato, maybe. You can cook some plantain. Yeah. I mean, I guess you cook, like, you know, for pies or whatever. But yeah, I see what you're saying. Not like oil a it. pot of oil. Yeah, that's true. I guess I can't argue with that. It looks delicious, though. Yeah. I love me some salt. <laughs> Salt's like the best thing ever. Okay, I'll try some now. Is it fine? Everything looks good, but you can't smell it. You can't taste it. I you know. just think, oh, looks good. Pomegranates mm -hmm. and grapes. Those are the most annoying things to I prepare. Know. Yeah, they are. Your boy. This has had to take them all day. Peeling all of those fruits, pitting all the fruits, and then actually cooking them. The consistency is Ooh, absolutely amazing. Stormy background. Yeah. Finish up before it rains. Seriously. I wonder if they are slightly like thinking that too. Like, oh crap. That is some rice. rice. Holy moly. You spilled it! There's your curd. I told you. It's a rice and curd. Mm. Oh, where's the Yeah, serious issues. That's really good. I don't know what that is, though. Tempery. Mabilai Mutukal! Oh, in the rice. That is crazy. And this thing's not on fire. It's just, uh, they're just mixing it. Oh, great. Beautiful. Look at all those pretty colors. Yeah. It's like Christmas. 
That's gotta be a serious workout. Seriously. They're all standing. He's like, come on, people, help me out. Mm. Yeah, it looks beautiful. Looks like a rice pudding. So interesting. Too late. Too late for what? Does it taste like rice pudding? I don't know. You should make it for me. It's impressive for uh, when they eat with their hands, like how they can get like a big old bite with their fingers. We would have no idea since we're so used to utensils. Yeah, it'd be all everywhere, all over the floor. we don't have captions for this. We don't know what he's saying. But I'm sure he's saying it's delicious. Yeah, let us know what he's talking about. Well, he gives us captions for, like, certain things. I'm going to say they had some people eating with them. Are they going to go to the, the shelters or the, the places? And here they are. Just a little bit of that fruit on the side. Just a little bit, yeah. It's amazing. These people are older, and they're just sitting on the floor. Like in America, older people they they can't even bend down. Like yeah. they're not getting on the I floor. I won't be able to get back up. No, they sit on a couch, and that is it. A chair, like that's it. Not a floor. So that's crazy. I was like, are they going to do it again? Right? Is there a bonus video? So, so fascinated by the fruit. Never heard of that fruit. Never mm -hmm. seen that fruit before in my entire life. Wonder what it tastes like. Let us yes. know if there's any like more popular fruit. There's a comparison for it. It, seeing that kind of reminded me of like the first time I opened up a dragon fruit and you see like that oh, cookies yes. and cream white and black color mm -hmm. inside and it's dragon fruit is not my favorite it doesn't have the strongest flavor to it but it definitely isn't a bad tasting fruit um, these rambutans uh, I'm gonna have to see if we can try to get some here yeah. at some of the markets or whatever but look at that fish one all those 10 million tiny fishes there's no way you're going to cut each and every one of those open, right? You know, it's not fishes. It's just fish. It's a million tiny fish. Oh, excuse me. What do you think about that? That was cool. I, I really do want to try one of those fruits as well. Absolutely. I actually really want to try that curd rice. That looked delicious. All you got to do is make it. I don't know how to. <laughs> we just saw the instructions. Okay. How much <laughs> curd do you need? How do you make curd in the first place? You get one of those bucketfuls of curd. Yeah. It was homemade curd. <laughs> oh, you can make that too. Um, but this was fantastic. I love watching. It's, it's like it's so like soothing for me and hypnotizing, and also makes me very hungry, but in a good way. Makes me uh, want to be able to explore more and see what's out there. And always fascinated with how easy they, these guys make it look, how clean they do it. How like she would say, they don't get it all themselves. Like I would have like all this food stain over my clothes, working all day doing that. And they're just happy. And let us know if you can help translate a little bit of what, basically the gist of what they were talking about in a few parts. There's more talking in this one. But if you enjoyed our reaction, don't hit the, forget to hit the like button, subscribe, and until next time. Ciao.